Welcome to the video. The gang is all here. How's everybody doing? It's Sunday. Here's the Italian earrings you saw in the... It wasn't a short. It was just like a shortened video. Um, 16-1-6. They're marked on the post. They're marked on the earring backs. 925 Italy. And they're fabulous. Quite a bit of sterling there. Pause and read if you want to join us. I was just out watering. Um, I take a little, like a gallon jug of water, which is exercise for me. And I take it over, trying to save this one plant that we've had for years. And uh, we did, Ruby and I did get some watering done last night, so that's always a big deal. This thing is sealed. This will be a dollar. It's, um, I think it's a plastic heart made to look like copper. This needs two things fixed. It's going to be $5 as is but it's incredible it's glass and set with prongs not glue so if you can fix that I, I imagine it was like a bigger bead like these faux pearls but just larger that's what i think was in there you'll need two of something i just i'm not going to fix it and sell it as authentic it's not right this is authentic what you see absolutely gorgeous this is this is cold it's glass i believe two dollars this is a dyed stone, $4. Nice cuff. Yellow. Yellow makes me feel good. These are cute, and they are a designer. And I don't know. It's They're hard to look up. It's a bee and a green shamrock-looking thing. $5. They are little enamel children and they have the front and the back you know i think they're all girls a cuff two dollars it sticks to a magnet meaning it's not copper or one dollar aurora borealis Um, here's how you put it on. I'll leave it like that. Two dollars. It, it does not stick. So it's brass. I don't think it's a precious metal because I, I looked for a mark, but I didn't test it. So you just never know. Really nice, big, two dollars rhinestone. Full of rhinestone. Huge hoops. Gorgeous. They're big. Now, this is a nice ring. The problem is all the rhinestones are gone. And it's brass. And it's adjustable. It's got a couple left. I like it just like it is, personally. $4 as is. Here's another one that was either brass or copper, I believe, or cast aluminum. It's it's just down to the copper if it had a gold, you know, it's down to the copper. Three dollars. Let's see how what the size is. Because it is not adjustable. Size 
six. I'm having some coffee. Um, I did a breathing treatment because I had stopped doing them, but I really need them. I've always had, you know, issues. So in the last 10 years, Um, $3 glass toggle. Boy, I have a mess going on on eBay with an item. $2, a little solitaire. $1 stretch. I don't know that I even want to talk about it, but it's just something that's never happened. We used to sell years ago. We've sold under lots of different names, but then, you know, $3, sparkle hematite. Anyway, I had a Marion Haskell the other day, so I put it on for $275 necklace. This is beautiful, $2. Are these real feathers? Because actually, yeah, they've been like treated somehow and they're gorgeous. So I just get I've been dealing with it. So anyhow, it it mailed out of here. Dulce Vita. $4. And a lot of, most of the time, our guy or gal does not scan in. When they pick it up, doesn't scan it in. So that's why when I tell y'all they're on the way, but you go to the tracking waiting information from the carrier it's because the person here is supposed to scan it in but i'm not going to gripe about it because it's not going to do me any good you know it'll just make the mail carrier mad he has to come up here anyway two dollars kind of a long i don't know if you can i was seeing if it would like i think it may be supposed to go like this I'm not sure. So anyhow, it never got updated along the way to Sarasota, Florida. It's a person in China, but they they have people, you know, here that they send to, and a lot of people do that on eBay. This is absolutely gorgeous. Banded agate at clear agate and rose quartz, $8. So I said, after a while, it was about 10 days. I just said, um, look at these. Wow. Rhinestone, $9 pierced. Wow. I just email. I'm just going to, y'all can fast forward. I just, um, I said, uh, you know, I wrote him and I said, I'm keeping an eye on, that's what I had been doing. And then I said, I'm going to, uh, oh, by the way, Marion Haskell was on for 24 hours. They made an offer of 200. I took the offer. They paid. I mailed. It never got updated. So I said, um, I've never lost a package. I don't think it's missing, but it's not up. No one's updating it. So let me do a missing mail whatever search please give me a couple days you know and this is still early in 10 8 9 10 days in from the purchase well right away they go file a, a, a day and i did do that and they go file on ebay and get ebay to freeze the funds and start threatening this and that and unless i refund so we refunded Refunded their $200, and guess what? Within 24 hours of me putting in the mail thing, all of a sudden, pop, pop, pop. Here's what everybody was supposed to be doing their job along the way. It tells you exactly where it's been. And it was out for delivery to them, to their little people here in Sarasota. So I wrote them and blah, 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 and I said, please have your agent return to sender. You know, just write on their return to sender. 
Um, no, it was picked up from the post office, delivered and picked up. So they are not communicating with their agent <clears throat> and um, <clears throat> not communicating with me. And I also said, if you do want the item, I'll put it, I'll relist it and we'll just mark it as shipped and, you know, as shipped. No, crickets. So they're getting the item. Their agent has the item. It's probably on its way to China. <clears throat> so I filed, I had to get help from eBay. It's not easy because it, this doesn't fit in, because it's like buyer has, now the buyer has not paid, you know, because <laughs> they, they're, they're keeping the item. They're not returning it. It's a weird situation, but what they did was they didn't wait like I asked them to. So give me, give me a day or two. Let's let this mail tracking, whatever I file, let's see what it does. Nope. They went straight to eBay because they wrote me, shouldn't you refund me? And I said, well, can we give it a day or two? Then they went to eBay. $5. That's gorgeous glass. That's just part of it, but it's, it's sad, isn't it? All these, $4 for all these. And this one, $4. $4 glass. It looks like our glitch has gotten a lot better, thank goodness. That was really bad. Two dollars, they're all together. Bangle. This is gorgeous. Boy, the rhinestones today are amazing. Seven dollars. Wait a minute. Yeah, it's seven dollars red rhinestone and clear. Ruby and diamonds. Dangle, pretty heavy, a dollar. This one shows some, uh, you don't want these. Well, I don't know, I'll let you, I'll just leave it. It looks like it was done at the factory like that or wherever. Here's some plastic angel wings, two dollars. Earrings, two dollars glass. Pretty color, memory wire. These are gonna go to Liz. There they are, Liz. You'll get these four with that necklace you bought so that you can do different, I'll put this in with these others, different scents. This is a gorgeous necklace here. What's happening here? Um, it's got a nice class, but I don't see a maker. You know, and it's got natural looking shell. And this I think is plastic, $5. Interesting statement with nice gold, golden, fairly chunky on the chain there. These will be free purple flower disc earrings. So in a way we got scammed. <laughs> With, I mean, it was unintentional, but four dollars. The chakras beautiful with the pumice stone, one dollar an apple charm. Uh, these are the sin, it's the company of. Um, that kitty thing, four dollars plastic earrings, they're cute. Send Reese or something, I don't know. Haven't taken the time to figure that one out. Vintage hematite, four dollars. Gorgeous. Wait, no, it's yeah, it's like a um, it might be glass, it's very catches the light, four dollars glass. You'll get these, per these are plastic, but they'll go with it. They just go perfectly, so they're gonna go. 
uh, glass three dollars and I think it's rose quartz this will be free it's like a bracelet some more fantastic glass earrings four dollars it's a golden and like a smoky glass pierced two dollars missing missing little whatever's Lo missing a lot of the accent it's still a very nice design i wouldn't be worried about it looks like it's just the way it's supposed to be two dollars life is tough but so are you well <laughs> sometimes your toughness gets worn down three dollars glass teal glass toggle oh this looks like it might be garnet i'm not sure Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I really don't. Three dollars. It's a bracelet. Blue, light blue, aquamarine in color, rhinestone. It's marked like whoever makes it. Bunch of letters. Three dollars glass pretty purple three dollars with the silver tassel very pretty perfect on the plating three dollars silver tone metal beads and then very interesting gold tone pink and sparkle very nice necklace Glass, four dollars. Blues bracelet. I don't see any marks. New on card or with card. Glass, blues, Cookie Lee. You can't. I mean, it's got a thing over it, but it's Cookie Lee, four dollars. It is a necklace. Oh, there it is. New. Earrings. That stone right there. And wooden. Three dollars. That's a pretty one. It's by you and I, four dollars. It's oh, I'll fix it. It just needs that to go in there. I'll fix that. Cry baby, three dollars. Cry baby. One dollar rhinestone gold tone. Real pretty earrings. Tiny rhinestone. Three dollars faceted with flower glass. Kind of a dark gray color. I don't know who this is. Two dollars. It's um, ball chain design and it hangs down. Plastic. Two dollars. Black and tan. The tan is wooden. 
And this is tied with a string. Somebody strung it. I want to call that Heshi shell, Heshi with, I'm not sure if, I don't think this is stone. Four dollars, I don't know. It's nice. Well, I think we'll stop there. So thank you, God bless. And thanks for listening, those that did, to my eBay crazy, crazy twists of a story. See y'all tomorrow. Have a great Sunday night.